and welcome to LA. I'm so excited to be here. I have never been to California before. I've never been to the West Coast of America before. So I'm ridiculously excited to be in LA today. So as you probably know, I've come um, to California with Trek America. We're here for eight days. So I just did a poll on Twitter and asked you guys what you kind of wanted to see video wise. And most of you said you wanted more regular vlogs. So kind of one or two day vlogs. So I'm gonna vlog obviously every day um, and try and fit in maybe one or two days per vlog depending on how much I get recorded. So we arrived really late last night. Um, actually not that late, but it felt super late because of jet lag. The flight from London Gatwick was about 11 hours. We travelled with Norwegian Airways, which is a budget airline, um, but it wasn't that bad. The airplane was really modern. It was a Dreamliner, which is really good because you um, you benefit from like their new air circulation thing. So none of us got poorly on the plane, which is great. Um, although you did have to pay for blankets and pillows, which was rather random, but luckily I had some with me. As you all know, if you watched my pack with me video, Anyway, um, so yeah, we arrived quite late. Um, it was about seven o'clock. We were all feeling really, really tired. We met with our team leader um, and the rest of the group, and then we headed out to dinner. We went to a place called Marina Del Mar, which is obviously on the bay. We had a really, really nice dinner, um, very American, just huge portion sizes. But I didn't stop vlogging just because I was so tired. And then we came back to our hotel and we're staying here for two nights. This is called the Aloft El Segundo. Um, and I'm not sure if all Trek America are trips include kind of like a hotel as nice as this at the beginning um but yeah this is my room it's fairly basic nothing too snazzy but it's it's nice it's very um very comfortable i'm actually in a room by myself whereas a couple of the guys are sharing with um with someone else as i said there's eight of us here all together um but i think we'll be switching around the rooms and i was quite grateful <laughs> to have a room to myself last night i do like my own space and i'm sure i'm not going to get much of that this trip but anyway, I'm gonna go meet the guys now for breakfast. And today we are exploring LA, doing all the main sites, um, Venice Beach, Hollywood Sign, Hollywood Stars. So let's get going. Aaron just gave us our um, briefing for breakfast. So we kind of know what the plan is. We know roughly the rules um, and what we're gonna be getting up to. Um, but before we go any further, I want to introduce you to the team so you're not wondering who's that in the background of your video. So first of all, we've got Danny. So Danny works with um, PR for Trek America, but lucky lady is pretty much just on a holiday, aren't you? Yeah, it's a tough job. It's a tough job. I think I think I want Danny's job. And then over here we got Scott from Intrepid Escape. Say hi Scott. We got Scott. And then over here we got the girlies. We got Hello. Chloe and Laura. Hi guys. Darren is uh, plugged in. This is our team leader, Darren. Down here looking super fabulous, we've got Amy looking very pretty in pink and Maddie is over there and behind me we've got Lindsay and Greg, Lindsay is from Trek America and Greg is going to be catching every moment on video and finally I'm here with Helen and her boyfriend Matthew, so that is the whole gang and we're going to head off now and I think our first stop is Venice Beach. So we're in the tour bus, we're on Bessie, apparently the bus is called Bessie. Um, we're going to be spending a lot of time here in the next few days. We're with the lovely Maddie, and uh, we're heading to the beach. That is me!
So behind me is the infamous Muscle Beach where Maddie and I are about to go and do a circuit session. Come see Muscle! <laughs> Sadly there are no Arnold Schwarzenegger wannabes but um, we're hoping they're coming. Coffee is gone cold, it's like time froze. There you go with you floating down I wish it Beverly Hills, Maddie and I are just risking our lives to get the perfect Instagram photo. But this street is so beautiful, it's like stereotypical LA. You've got the palm trees lining the road, and these houses, oh my god, look. Oh, that one looked like a council house, not that one. This one behind me, they're so stunning. So we're now just gonna make our way to the Beverly Hills sign. Rodeo Drive is like just there. So um, yeah, really exciting, the sun's finally come out and it finally feels like we're in proper LA. <laughs> Can't do anything without this one in the background. Gosh. <laughs> Like having our own personal paparazzi. <laughs> yeah. So we are now on Rodeo Drive and I'm not gonna lie, this is completely surreal because I have seen this place in films so many times. Pretty Woman, one of my favorite films of all time. Um, and it's just so crazy to actually be here. I need to pinch myself every 10 seconds. It's shopping heaven. Ah! Chanel and we're now in Tory Burch and I may have bought something in each of them. I did really good and um, straight. Good, yeah. <laughs> That's soon to change because I think yeah. they're about to walk past a Sephora. Valentino and some sandals that I've had my eye on are in the sale, 40% off. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really, really tempted. Don't know why I'm feeling really spendy today, but oh, the things that Rodeo Drive does to you, I can see why Pretty Woman went absolutely crazy around here. Have you spotted anything that you like, darling? I have, but I'm being very restrained. Tory Birch bag is calling Maddie's name. <laughs> I've just learned about a new phenomenon. It's called the videographer run. It's called it's called the little gay the little, cam run. Little gay cameraman run. Give us an example, Greg. Do I have to? Yes, you have to. It's, it's, it's like you have to do it. It's for a reason. Okay. So ready. it's to get that super smooth shot. Ready for this? Yes. Look at the stance. Don't, don't laugh too much. Three, two, two, one, go. Look at that. Such a pro. So this is how you get those super smooth shots. Yes. Great work. Right hand over there. Are you right handed? Yeah. yeah. So that one right hand. Yeah. Okay. This one you don't really hold it. So this one you don't hold it. You just, you use your fingers. Balancing it. Yeah. But now, and then bend your knees and run that way. So bend your knees and run. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Lower. Lower. Hey, come back. Hey, where are you going with my camera? Come back with my camera. <laughs> Yeah, lower, lower, smaller steps, smaller steps, get lower, smaller steps, smaller steps. <laughs> You're a natural pro, absolute pro, pro, oh nice. We're now on our way to um, do a trek 
up towards the Hollywood sign. I changed my top so I can at least try and get a bit of tan. We've got some shoes going on the bus, driving down Sunset Boulevard. After a 40 minute road trip in the car, we are now at the top of the Hollywood Hills. Um, I've got a slight change of outfit. I changed my top so that I could get a bit of a tan um, and I've put on some trainers because we're now going to trek from the observatory, which is that way, um, to the Hollywood sign, which is over there. You can't really see it at the moment, but it's so surreal. I just caught a glimpse of it and it's another one of those things that again, I've seen in so many movies and TV shows and actually seeing it for real life. It's it's really amazing. Can you spot it yet? Can you spot it yet? There it is, the Hollywood sign. We're trekking over there now. to see the Hollywood sign. <laughs> We've now come to the heart of Hollywood. I'd kind of say this is like the Piccadilly Circus of LA maybe. Um, and we're just meeting a tour guide. And, um, oh look, this is my first job. Her first selfie in LA. Okay. Um, this is not my first. <laughs> Oh, it wasn't me. No. So we're going to meet um, a tour guide and we are going to walk down the Hollywood Walk of Fame. And it's going to be amazing. What should I try to impress you? Right here is the hotel where Pretty Woman uh, was set in her more prosy days. 